everyone, Tony here. Beautiful day today on the White Mountains of Northern Arizona. Today we're going to be making some tacos al pastor. We're going to be using some pork, which we started marinating yesterday. It's been about 24 hours, and we're going to be working in my kitchen today, which is outdoors with a grill and with a smoker and etc. etc. That's where I feel at home. Uh, so we have some pineapple we're going to slice up for it, and we're going to go to the grill. All right, I have my pork boneless ribs cut into quarter inch pieces. For my adobo I'm going to use some chili powder mix, some pasilla, some beer, one habanero. We have some dried chipotles, but we also have canned. If you do not have access to that, we have some pineapple juice. We have some ground donato, some sriracha, some garlic powder, cumin, onion, lemon pepper, some rice vinegar because I like the flavor. It's light. Olive oil, chili powder, or chili pepper, some uh, Maggie, and some oregano, and my Chinese style cleaver. All right, this has been marinating for 24 hours. We use some uh, boneless country pork ribs, and we have our pineapple, which we're going to slice up. It's going to be delicious. Okay, so I have uh, the pork on two grilling trays, and I've cut my pineapple in slices uh, or strips and put it on top. Normally, you would skewer this, but because we don't have the time to do the skewers and slow cook it, we're going to do it this way. And I've got my um, adobo that I'm going to add to the meat as it's cooking. Let's go outside. And if you're wondering, yes, I prefer to use charcoal. I'm going to do a little trick that Rivet Gardner showed me on his YouTube channel. Uh, it's right there. Check it out. Going to use some hickory wrapped in foil. Mm -mm -mm. We're back in my kitchen. We've got the, the coals ready. We're going to cook this covered for a little bit, and once you know, it's starting to rain. Mmm, smells fantastic. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Just flipped them, basted them with beer, and oh my gosh, this smells so perfect. Alright, so now for the finish, we have some kosher salt, and oh my gosh. This smells wonderful, and yes, those are jalapenos. Our jalapenos are getting toreados, and this stuff is a super wow.